Transparency and accountability, that's what members of Boise's refugee community want from the Boise Police Department. That's right, protesters gathered last night to seek answers after a uh, Boise police shooting that injured a man last month. Our Ricardo Coronado has more. Some community members is coming together in front of City Hall to make sure their voices are heard. They say Muhammad Nkoma was the person Boise police officers shot on June 27th in the area of North 36th Street. According to Boise police, officers were responding to a possible child abduction. Community members believe Muhammad is being misportrayed. Calling him a suspect when he's really a victim because um, you know, we deserve to know what's going on. We want the footage. We want to hear the 911 call, like what was going on? What led from that six minute to for Mahmoud to get shot? Mano says they're working to learn more about what happened as Muhammad recovers at the hospital. Accountability, safety and um, transparency. We just want justice for Mahmoud and also we want justice for everyone that has been this kind of situation because our community right now is very torn because we call Boise home. You know, we came from a country where it was, you know, war. Now we're here. We thought, you know, it was going to be safer. We feel like this happened. We're, we're like, you know, taking steps back because we are scared. Mano says they've had discussions with Boise Mayor Lauren McLean and Boise Police Chief Ryan Lee. We have nothing against the police. Mm -hmm. We just want this community to be safer for everybody. Yes. So that, you know, when I'm walking out there, I don't have to be nervous mm -hmm. or get nervous if I'm home for my brothers. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. So that's that's all we want. And, yeah. you know, the mom, all she wants is peace and justice for her son. That's all she wants. Carter Coronado, Idaho News 6.